haven't seen one and today we're just going to give you a quick tip of all of the cricket and um, kit like cricket keeping and everything so let's start with the batting so which one do I do first? Cup drive here. When you're doing the cup drive, just take your, you should just um, leave your foot there a bit, and then you can just really straight back and just come over the foot. Um, and the back foot should stay nice and still. But if it's um, sometimes if it's come down the off a bit and you still want to play, you must come a bit to the off and come. But if we think it's going to come off the off and they're going to play there and they're going to play on the stumps, you can just, you don't have to play a cover drive instead. Instead, you must play like a um, flick. So it's easy to get the ball in. So, you know, you can get them out with a um ball and if they're on the stump so now which one um sweep okay now i'm going to use a bit of sweep batting so first you need this your front foot to come forward and your back is really coming like to the back of your back and then that's come across your foot so just you kneel down on the back foot and just keep in that to a, um, a sweep in it across the ground. Reverse sweep. Okay. Reverse sweep is the hardest one to play for me, but taking your back foot forward, your back supposed to be nice and up, then you can bring it down there and sweep it. Instead of this, the other foot, you just do that side. I think we'll be done with the batting for now. Your, your cap's coming off, Shane. Sorry. Right now, how I do, um, what should I do now? Um, can we look at some bowling tips, please? Bowling tips? What kind of bowling? Leg spinner? Leg sure. break? I'm the best bowler at that. So, I will teach you five different deliveries. First is called the um, leg break. I just um, that's why I won't throw it outside. This is the leg break, and I'll teach you the leg break first. So the grip is two fingers up and two fingers down, and your thumb is supposed to go on the bottom. Instead. A spin is like this, but instead it's like the back of the palm is supposed to face in you. I'll just do a little couple. Okay. So, you see, I flicked my finger a bit in stuff. Come on. pause it. You've two. done two, I think. Okay, so then... Um, now, um, can you do a, 
spinner. Spinner's easy. Um, spinner being over spinner. Sure. Over spinner doesn't spin, but the batsman thinks it's going to spin, but it's not actually. Sneaky. So, what you're supposed to do is kind of like the leg work, remember? Remember the leg work? I do. Instead of the back palms facing you, it should be facing away from you. Mm. And that's the same with the grip and everything. But that's the um, leg, leg break, back of the palm is facing you. But in this one, it's like this. Back of the palm is facing So you hear this. That's awfully good. That's too good. Just now we'll dust the um let's two no three down, right? Hmm. Can we do Chinaman? Chinaman? Yeah. Now what I'm gonna teach you some really um good Chinamans. So in a Chinaman Remember, you remember the googly? Yeah. Googly's this way. In the Chinaman, can you see that's in um, the Chinaman? This is facing batsman, and the other is facing um, batsman also. What can you see? In the googly, it's like um, a bit. The back of the palm is facing him, but in the other, he just turn it a bit, and then it should be like come out. Like this. Can I ask them to let them come in? Hmm. Oh, that's not bad, but... How many times have I teached Hmm, I think we've... Four. Done four, have we? So, last one. What's I do for the last one? Um, fastball? Fastball is easy. Okay, that's Can fine. Can do so slow one? Sure. That's a bit hard, but it's still a bit easy. The slow one's the easiest though. So, instead of, do you know the fastball? Uh, go on, remind me. So, these two fingers, your index finger should be on this side. Mm -hmm. And your middle finger is on the other. Mm -hmm. Thumb is supposed to go on the bottom mm -hmm. and then just come fast. Right. But the snowball is turned a little bit. I see. It's the same way, but that's the. But dust, it seems. It's, it does go slow because that's going to be. Um, I just see you a couple of fast ones fast, maybe? Sure. You're going to do a what? Snowball. Snowball. It's a bit better. It's definitely a bit slow. Um, oh yeah. How does the um, wicket keeping off you do? Do a bit of wicket keeping, that'd be great. So, now I'm just giving some wicket keeping tips. So, if it's, uh, you said, be a little on the offside, you can actually see the ball, and as soon as it rises up, you should come up with the ball. Dust. It has to go past the wickets before you hit, get the ball. If it's going down on the leg a bit, you should jump across like the captain must come. And the wrong, th you don't have to, you don't do this. The bad thing to do is that you don't. You have to move your whole body and then hit the wicket. If it's a spinner, it, you will have to wait for the ball. It will leap. You come to the middle of the stumps and then when it's rising up, you can just cut it in, go like that. And that's... Let's do this in the field. Perfect. Okay. Now I'll give you a couple of field and tips. So... One, I'll give you five different ways to cut, three different ways to cut the ball when it's coming down, when you're trying to cut the ball and get them out. So, 
first would be these. Okay. So your hands like this, and they come, and they should come to the um, one is this side, and the other can be sometimes this side. That's one one. Now what it does do when it's coming up really high, so you go like this. And it's supposed to come underneath your um, head. The last one is about this. Okay, so like that. That's um, all of the high one. So that's all of it today. Done. Great. Thanks very much, Shane.